This is one more question based on this property that's called linear pair XZ, which says that in a straight line, I say, for example, if a ray stands on a straight line, the sum of two adjacent angles so formed is equal to 180 degree. This is the property. Let's see what the question says. As you can see, there's a figure given here and uh, but that it says that these are the rays, right? These are O, P, O, Q, O, S, O, R are the rays. These are the four rays. And what we have to prove that sum of these angles, that is angle P, O, Q plus angle Q, O, R plus angle R, O, S and the finally plus angle P, O, S. The sum of these four angles is 360 degree. Well, ordinarily, uh, all of you know that sum of all angles around a point is 360 degree, right? Which we already know from the property that sum of all angles around a point is 360 degree. But in this case, we are supposed to prove this property. So we cannot directly say so. So for that, we are going to use this uh, property called linear pair. Before that, you need to draw a ray, right? There is a construction part. So this is the construction part where you are going to draw a ray, right? Say I name it OT. Say I named it OT opposite to OQ. So you have can write this construction and it is important that you must mention the construction that produce ray OQ backwards so that a point to a point T. And clearly, whenever you produce a ray backward, it becomes a straight line. Now we have this as a straight line. You should know that this being a straight line now. Now what I can do is uh, start uh, applying the linear pair. First of all, considering this to be a straight line, as I said, this is a straight line, then sum of angles, these two adjacent angles will be 180 degree. So that's what we will write in the first step. We'll write since TOQ is a line, is a line, so therefore, the sum of these angles and the angles here is, say I named this angle P O T plus angle P O Q is equal to 180 degree. And that is from linear pair, right? The reason is linear pair and I mark it equation one. Now, since it is uh, a line, therefore the sum of these three angles below will also be 180 degree from the same property and we can continue to write this angle say T O S plus angle S O Q S O R sorry plus angle R O Q is equal to 180 degree reasons remains the same and this is the second. Now in the next step we'll be adding these two equations right that is adding 1 and 2. So if I add these equations, what we get? You see, we'll get angle P, O, T. I'm adding vertically plus angle T, O, S plus angle P, O, Q plus angle S, O, R and plus angle R, O, Q. And you can see that uh, if you add the right hand side, you will get this as 360 degree. Now check what you can say about the sum of these two angles, that is POT and TOS. See what you can say about the sum of these two angles. If you see in the figure, that is POT and TOS. Let me show you in the figure. So if I say that P O T plus angle T O S can be written as P O S. So I'm going to replace this with angle P O S. The sum of these two as P O S plus the other angle that is will be as it is P O Q plus angle S O R plus angle R O Q is equal to 360 degree. This is what we had to prove in this question. 